What's up guys, Lock here, and uh, today we're going to do something a bit different, as I have ordered, I ordered some, as you can see, these Yu-Gi-Oh! booster boxes. Um, so me and my brother Neil here, um, we are going to open them up, we're going to build some decks, and we are going to have a few games with each other. So, which pack do you want anyway? I'll just start from this, if you'll start from that. Oh, I'm just going to show it. Right. I'll grab a hand. Ooh. So we ordered these, well I ordered these online uh, and they actually arrived like two weeks ago. Um, so we've been waiting to do this anyway, just use the time off. Uh, that was a cool card, Call of the Mummy. Very good one for zombies. Yeah. I got Mythical Beast Cerberus. Oh, I hate you. I hate you so much <laughs> right now. <laughs> I got a super rough recklessly. Oh, nice. Uh, target one beast monster you control and one monster your opponent controls. Destroy the first and shuffle the second into the deck. Good one. Okay. Lord Poison. This is destroyed by battle and sent to the graveyard. Target a plant type monster in your graveyard. Except Lord Poison. Go to someone that target. Nice. Some interesting cards there. Mm -hmm. I got a cross sword beetle, which is a weird hitter. We've also got these legendary dragon cards in the middle. I'm hoping we'll have time to have a few games of each other. We've both got a set of meat, so that'll be fun. I got Seed of Flame, 1600. When this card, when this card you control is destroyed by a card effect, and sent to the graveyard, target a level 4 or a lower plant type monster from your graveyard except Seed of Flame. Special summon that target, and if you do, special summon the seed token to your opponent's side of the field in defend position and the token cannot be used for a tribute summon. So, lots of cool. Yeah. yeah. Damage gates, very handy. Got X Saber Air Bellum. See if we can get a card in shot. So, this basically deals that if you, I can discard cards from your opponent if it deals battle damage. Mm -hmm. Very handy card for X Saber. Yeah. Arsenal Bug! Nice. Awesome. Control no one type monsters, it's like it, attack and threats become thousand. <laughs> oh, that's two thousand. Nice. Oh, shiny. Tri Edge Levia. Oh, I don't know that one. I don't think XYZ monster. monster. Yeah. Really it? hope this is in shot. <laughs> um, banish any monsters destroyed by battle with this card. Once per turn during either player's turn, you can detach one material and target one face at monster in the field and it loses 800 attack and its effects are negated. And these changes will last until the end of the turn, so... Great! I got a Blast with Chain trap card. Target a face at monster you control, gains 500 attack. And if, it, if this card is destroyed by a card effect or well equipped, target one card in the field and destroy it. Ooh, nice. Ooh, a classic. Classic. Kunai with Chain. <sighs> Love it. But no entry. Well, that too. Uh, all monsters go to defense mode. Oh, nice. Victory Viper. I've used that enough times in uh, Duel Links. <laughs> Tutan Mask. When a spell slash trap card activate targets exactly one zombie monster in the field and no other cards, negate the activation and destroy it. Ooh, cool, shiny. Uh, Mi Mizuki? Mizuki. Mizuki, yeah. Very handy card. Uh, can banish this card from the graveyard and target one zombie monster in your graveyard, special summon that target. Very handy for vampire it's decks. It's like a really angry back battle ox. Mm. It's very handy for for vampire decks. Because they usually get the effects when they get summoned. Or special summon from the grave. I got Valhalla. Hall of the Fallen. Nice shiny one. Okay. Um, allows, if I remember correctly, for to special summon one fairy monster per turn from your hand. Uh, but you must control no monsters to, result, to use the effect. I am looking forward to building decks with these. <laughs> I got Leotar, um, Cards Battles, a oh, yeah. no, non-normal monster, gains 500 attack. Nice. I'm getting loads of Fiend cards. How can a Fiend be a light monster? How can Mythical Beast of Circuit, being a, clearly a Demon Scorpion, be a Fairy? Fair enough. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, Electromagnetic Bagworm. What? <laughs> um, target what flip effect? He knows more about this game than me. I've been collecting since it started. <laughs> target one machine type monster your opponent controls. Take control of that target until your next end phase. 
If this card is destroyed by battle, the monster that destroyed it loses 500 attack and defense. And it looks like a large type, a, a, a huge amount of, if you can, um, if you can see it, uh, computer chips. It's so cute. Of course. The card ba <laughs> inflicts battle damage to your opponent by battle. Gain life points equal to the battle damage. It's so cute. Shooting Doji. I don't know this one. Magician Kunai. Reflect. It right. looks like it's going eight Saiyan. Tsuzaru! Okay. Once per turn you can act like one of its effects. Banish two zombie monsters from your graveyard to draw a card. Target one of your banished zombie type monsters place that card at the top of your deck. Not so bad. And he's definitely going Saiyan. So yeah, as, was, as, as my brother mentioned, he's been collecting a lot longer than me. I am. My Duel Links is uh, more my speed for the game. Which I am loving every second of it, of every day. Two magical. Oh, Windstorm of Akita. It's a key. That's a, that's a handy one. Yeah. Changes to defense change, as well. Ch change all battle positions, not all, uh, not just to defense mode. Oh, okay. Magical exemplars. I have uh, a very sparkly one and a, mag and a shiny name one. I have Exploder Dragon. Nice. <laughs> Eight times spell card is accurate. Three two times last card. This card you can ring number spell card. Oh, right, of course. Yeah. Don't know if it will show up in the camera, but sparkly and shiny name. Is it a vampire? It's sparkly. <laughs> <laughs> it's a real fucking vampire. <laughs> <laughs> I got a golden flying fish. Wanna show it? You contribute one of the fish type monster, then target the one card in the field and destroy that target. Cool! <laughs> For lack of special words. <laughs> Gyroid. Oh, Red Yaki Bokeh. Red Yaki Bokeh. Uh, psychic card. I really like psychic monsters. Uh, I was never a big fan of myself. Kuda Chain. Yeah. Got a reptilian gorgon. Uh, Pyramid of Wonder. You should be in yeah, I got one as well. And everyone's favourite, Scapegoat. Air, or Air Orca. Flying whale? Looks to be. <laughs> well, there's flying fish, so why not a whale? Quantum Cat. Uh, that is a very good card. A trap card for the clear one monster type and one at special on this card. Another monster with that type and attribute. It's still also a trap card. Hmm. Very cool. Yeah, but that's also a very creepy picture. There's a lot of good trap cards, uh, trap monsters. Especially in one in one of the one one of the packs, I can't remember which one. Very shiny metamorph. Very nice. But um, there was one uh, for trap monsters. There's what there's more ones would now get effects whenever you summon a trap monster now. Mm -hmm. Um, so you can destroy the one's field at the same time. Okay. I want to use tiki storm now. Hmm. Yeah, there's quite a few more different ones. Um, there's two ones that look a bit like like tiki soul in total. Evil swarm old lantern. Never seen that before. You can tribute this card. Target one face that monster opponent controls and destroy the target. Because my blue eyes. Would you accept a dark bribe? Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> dark Crusader. Send one dark monster from your hand to the graveyard, and this card gains 400 attack points. Or visit a scripture for monster battles and opponent monster. Going down this calculation, you get all other card effects on the field control the damage, next damage, for the end of the damage step. Also, the damage calculation is used for this battle, you use each monster's original attack and defense. Forbidden cards are really nice. So basically, it negates the quick cards. Nice. The monster battles upon the monster defense negate all other card effects on the field until the end of the damage step. And that damage calculation is applied to the original attack, it negates everything. You heard it from him, negates everything. If he's wrong, blame him. It will negate any effect, any recurring effect, basically. 
Um, Ayers Rock Sunrise. This was Chumley's card from the uh, from the GX map. Uh, oh, yeah. yeah. Target one beast monster in your graveyard. Special summon that target. And if you do all face up monsters, your opponent controls lose 200 attack for each beast plant and winged beast type monster currently in your graveyard until the end phase. And yes, I said Chumley, I don't know the Japanese names. I don't think anyone's going to care. You'd be surprised. <laughs> Freya, the Spirit of Victory, one of the booster pack cover cards. Much in there. I I like that card. Hmm. To the one that you cannot target you. Yeah, that's what I like about some of the Chronics as well. Um, for for background. Chain Dog. Aww. Very cute looking looking dog looking dog. Cannot be used mm. as a synchro material. Except for the synchro summon of a beast type monster. If this card is in the graveyard, special summon this card. If you do, banish it when it leaves the field. You must control exactly two beast type monsters to action and result in them. I'm seeing a severe lack of monsters that actually need tributing in this. It's because it's the monster packs of mine. No, you don't really need to get it very often because it's because for a simple uh, combos and everything else. Call of the Atlanteans. Interesting there. Target three level three or lower sea serpent type monsters in your graveyard. Special summon all three of them. You cannot special summon any other monsters during the turn you activate this. But it's a very angry looking card. Oh yes. Shock to Perth! I love Shock to Perth. Yes, I Evil Heroes. Evil Heroes? Yes. Season 4 of GX, I think, or season 3. Basically, when Jaden got tempted to the powers of darkness, all his monsters became evil. And he got a few other ones. You, you, um, Grenosaurus, nice to see that. Curse of Anubis. I love Grenosaurus. Destroy monsters and then. Uh, I think this, is, uh, as, as you said, there's not many ones being tributing. I think because this is meant to be for things like X, what, um, X, Y, Z potentially. Oh, yeah, let's go. And we have the first number. Oh, we've got number 20, Giga Brilliant. Nice. Two level 3 monsters, detach one, X, one, one material from this card. All face up monsters you currently control gain 300 attack. Oh, we've got a tribute monster. Finally, we're finally. Fine. Stego Cyber. Have heard of it? Once or twice. It's not that good in one of the comics. But During your opponent's turn, that damage calculation. Um, if this card is in your graveyard, you pay a thousand life points, special summon it, and if you do, you take no battle damage from this battle. Uh, and banish this card when it leaves the field. This is a quick effect. You can use this. Well, you can only use it once per turn. I got another anime card. I got seven completed. Oh, right, yeah. For Bandit yeah. Keith. You have three of them, don't you? No, that's seven. And I got another anime card Sunlight Unicorn from 5Ds. The hell does that do? Um, once per turn, I've never, I've never seen 5Ds. Excavate the top card of your deck, so just reveal the top card. Mm -hmm. And if it's an equipped spell card, add it to your hand. Otherwise, it goes to the bottom of the deck. It's actually very good for searching. Thinking if I keep getting more I'm gonna, more of these vampire cards, I might just make a vampire deck. Well, they're very good vampire decks. They're one of my favourites. They're not top tier, but if you can get, you get a good combo, especially mm -hmm. as their XYZ is named after Bram Stoker. It's literally Vampire Knight Bram. Cool. Dodger Dragon. Dodger Dragon. This card's normal summon. This cannot be negated. Um, after this card is normal summoned, your opponent cannot activate counter trap cards for the rest of that turn. Looks so cool. I think I've gone back at this, I'm just look, I'm looking at Toon Gemini Elf! I see your Metal Morph and I raise you a rare Metal Morph. It fits in there. Beat <laughs> 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 you to it. <laughs> Not as good though, is it? The rare one. No, I just like to look at the rare. But they get spells. Of course, the attack boost still. But yeah, the attack boost only helps when you're attacking. So we can still go over. Sea Koala. With a black stego. Ooh, it's hard to one on control. Change the attack to zero until the end of this turn. You miss control the beast or monster. Oh, and this card's back. Great result the effect. I'm going to turn a monster where you control the zero attack. I'm going to hit you with some koalas. 
Well, here's hoping it's black. Ste- here's hoping it's black stego because if you attack it, it goes to defense port. <laughs> <laughs> I've got a shiny chained off. I got what adjustment? What adjustment? That do. Uh, mainly for the what monsters. Obviously. Funny enough, <laughs> I figured that part. <laughs> um, equip only to level three or lower thunder monster against eight of attack, but its effects are negated each time it like battle damage. Draw a card. Not exactly good for what monsters because most of their effects involve attacking directly. Mm. I got a heroic champion, um, Gandiva. I got enemy controller. That's always a handy one. I got Breaker, the magical warrior, so I see your enemy controller and I destroy it. <laughs> Not really. I can't actually do that. I am so looking forward to building these decks. Mm, it'd be nice to see. Nice to duel again. Yeah. Ooh, I got Inspiration. Hmm. And that does... Oh no, yeah, I remember that one. Yeah. Got a shiny Inspiration. Yes. He's not keeping these cards. Oh, They're mine. I paid for them. I know. Fine. Aha. Uh-huh. I got a shiny Exploder Dragon. You also got that card I was telling you about earlier. Okay. Festus of Galga. Inflict battle damage to your opponent. Uh, gain light life points equal to damage inflicted. Nice. Mm-hmm. Another kunai. I got Tiny Scaper. No, uh, shiny Magical Exemplar. That's nice. What'd you get? I iron. Is that a monkey thing? Yes, yeah, it was a kangaroo, yeah. Once per turn you can have a monkey. That is not a monkey. That's a fucking squirrel? Monkey. That's a kangaroo. Uh, no, I wouldn't say. It's a kangaroo in a minion's outfit. <laughs> Go show them. <laughs> it's a kangaroo in a minion's outfit. So you can get it can gain 400 attack, but it can't attack a turn you activate the effects. I guess that stacks then, 400 attack? Hmm? Does it say till end phase? No, it, it doesn't. stacks. Alright, Lord of Revealing Light and that. Awesome. Evil Spawns, Miller Breaker, Unstable Evolution. When your opponent's life points is lower, when your life points is lower than your opponent's, the equipped monster's original attack becomes 2400. While your life points are higher, it becomes 1000. Tag that to your koalas. You're gonna have to repeat that, I'm so sorry, I wasn't listening. Think, think Megamorph. Right, got you. <laughs> That's the easiest explanation. Uh, I'm not showing him this card. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm worried. <laughs> and so you should be. Lion alligator. What? Lion alligator. Alligator with a, with a uh, wig. Pretty much. Think meant that like the, like the Amazon advert. Right. Mm-hmm. Well, let's show it. Yeah. Any effects, sorry? Uh, oh yeah. Uh, well, you control reptile type monster. Other than this card, if a reptile monster you control attacks, it like piercing damage. Cool. Yeah. Well, those are afraid. Let's return to the Calm down, Kaiba. Ooh, gotta have money. Screw the rules, I have the Millennium Ring. <laughs> yeah, you win. <laughs> I, I, and, I remain, and I remain positive that the Millennium Ring would have been the strongest Millennium item. Look at that one there. Because if it wasn't for the parents of Good Always Wins, the core of the one. Pass me the box. Alright, just gonna put it there just so it saves. Give me three different. You turn your just booster packs and I've got quite a lot left. I got a tree otter. Tree otter? Yep. Uh, one per turn, target a face up monster you put in control, to get, so a face up monster you control, gains a thousand attack. Till the end of this turn, you must control a beast type monster, other than this card to activate it. So use your koalas to lower the attack, then use that to boost it by thousands. Alright. Fusion Sword Murasami Blade. Component a warrior type monster. 
gains 800 attack. While equipped to a monster, this card cannot be destroyed by card effects. Nice, but the monster can, I'm guessing. Cat, Royal Fire Scroll Guard. Top two of them already. So if this card is normal summon, target four pyro type monsters in the graveyard, shuffle all four into the deck, and then draw two cards. Warm worms. <laughs> I got a quantum cat. I like as warm well worms. I also got Jane, the Light Sworn Paladin. This card attacks, it gains trainer attack, but during each end phase, then top that card to your deck to the graveyard. Mm. Lights, well, that's what lights, what the original light swarms were based on, because they got you, you, had, you had to get light swarms, well, at least ten different light swarms. Ooh, you got a mech lord. He's cool. Um, what my favorite? What light swarms do so? Um, the idea was to get light swarm judgment dragon out, but it can only be summoned if there's ten. I think it's ten individual. Uh, some will correct those, I think. If there's ten individual, uh, also ten light swarm monsters with different names in the graveyard. Probably not 10, I just because I mean that number sticking out of my head. The Mech Lord Army of Grinnell. He's a very good one. Under attack, we can Lord Monster the field, except this card. This card is normal summon, you can target one thing that monster your opponent controls and half its attack until the end of this turn. He's a basic one of the servants of one of the Mech Lord Emperors, who, in this case, the one I'm, I'm thinking of, um, when summoned, he, mm -hmm. sorry, his attack will always be equal half your opponent's life points. Oh. But if you get him on the field first turn, because yeah, he get, yeah. because all the emperor gets summoned by get special it can be special summoned when one of your monsters is destroyed by a card effect. Breakthrough skill. That's a good one. Shiny. Target one face up effect monster your opponent controls. Negate the effect of that opponent's face up monster until the end of this turn. During your turn, except this except turn this card sent to the graveyard, you can banish this card from your graveyard. Then target one face up effect monster your controls and negate that target effect until the end of this turn. I got a Chaos Burst. Oh yeah, I'm just looking at that as well. <laughs> <laughs> so, while your opponent's monster declares an attack, tribute one monster and target the attacking monster. Destroy a target and put a thousand points of damage to your monster to your opponent. So you both lose a monster, but you take damage. Yeah. I got a Battle Storm, Winged Beast Monster, gains 100 attack for each Winged Beast Monster you control. Once per turn, target a spell or trap card your opponent controls and destroy it. You must control three or more Winged Beast Monsters to activate and resolve this effect. That looks cool. Yeah. I remember I was telling you, telling you about the rules that in com uh, they did at conventions for these. Yeah. All, the, all monsters of all types. No man, that, that Dialga, that, that Cestus of Dialga thing. Which one we did with the fairies. Yep, fair enough. Submarine Roid, always great. Free as a free, free damage. A free inner point attack damage. Yep. Offerings to the Doomed. Target one face up monster on the field. Destroy a target, let's give you an extra face. Fair enough. I suppose it's a quick card so I could play it on your turn. Yeah. Do you want me to open some of for you? Yeah, go for it. Why alligator? Black Velocity. Black Velocity? Velocity, like yeah. a Velociraptor. Yeah, that looks cool. Ooh, um, Medora. Not that good a card, but it gains 200 attack for each fairy type monster in your graveyard. So again, the, the rules still help throughout the tournament. Mm -hmm. uh, Put it on my side then. Yeah, I'll do it. This is a new one. That's in the for. During the other player's turn, you can tribute this card. Each warrior type monster you currently control gains 500 attack and defense until the next end of the next damage step. That monster is that next time that monster attacked or is attacked. It's not bad. Nothing interesting in that one. Oh, I've got a classic one for you. Shadow spell. I don't remember what that does. It's basically another just told you we're haunted. The door opened. <laughs> I'm not a believer. Hey, the hat fell earlier. Well, there's no proof of that. <laughs> well, Freya, Spirit of Victory. Banner of Courage, always handy. Yeah, very handy. Blue Thunder T45. Hmm. 
If this card destroys an opponent's monster by battle, special summon one thunder option token. Machine type light level four. Attack and defense fifteen hundred. This token cannot be attributed for attribute summons. Evil swarm thunder guard. Although it's one of the sixteen. It's one of the monsters with fifty attack points. Swords of revealing light. Say it with, say it with more. Say it with, say it with more certainty. A deeper voice. Yes. <laughs> say it with a deeper voice. No. <laughs> You, you do it. I, I can, I haven't got one. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> I got Jack Frost. Ghost Trick Monster. Oh, cool. Very cute card. I've never a big fan of the Ghost Tricks myself. Swords of Concealing Light. <laughs> uh. I got Tardy Orc. Very comedic looking. Oh, car. yeah, I love Tardy Orc. He's cool. Yeah. Gonogo. Hmm. Mm. End of the damage step. Uh, if this card battles a Tom's monster, change that monster to face down defense position. That's empty. <sighs> Move that to the side. Fashion shields are good. Fashion shields. Is that right? Cook the normal summon slash set monster. Okay, default an attack, you take no battle damage from attacks involved, involving it. Cool. Just for a thousand attack bonus. Y you've got Leo Tar now. Oh, sweet. Now Chain Dog. Oh, we've got another XYZ. What do you get? Um, Frack knows how that's pronounced. <laughs> Eva Gishki Merogeist. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> 